probably my team's, I would say, favorite warm-up activity, okay, over the years. Three versus three. Let's go three boys against three post-secondary type age girls. Let's, let's test that. Here's the rules, guys. You're three on three. Every time the ball clears the net, you must rotate. You're only allowed to forearm, pass, or set. And you're trying to score. It is competitive. Okay. Uh, John, do you mind? You just got balls there. Do you mind just tossing one in either side and we'll just alternate? Okay. Do we need to repeat those? You can set up any way you want. You must rotate every time the ball clears the net. You're only allowed to use this or this. Okay. Go. Yeah. Rotate. Psst, boys, don't cheat. You got to rotate. Yeah. Go, 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 go. You could get that. One nothing girls. Play to five. Here we go. All the male coaches got five push ups if uh, boys lose. All the women's coaches. You guys are already had one nothing. Get them. Uh, alternate. Why don't we alternate? All, so we're going to this side? Yeah. Okay, you ready? Are you honestly ready? One all. Go. Let's play to three. We'll play to three. Two one. Game point. Okay. Coming to your side, are you ready? Oh, that's three. Okay, man, here we go. Three squats, three push ups. Let's go. You guys, five for sure. Uh, sometimes I've said, here's why I like this drill A, they like it, B, it is random. And it creates a ton of angles and a ton of, you know, different touches that you don't normally get. If, I'm just going to say, if I had done that with the U14 girls, here's what likely would have happened. They would have been very precise in their triangle, and they would have taken three contacts every time to set it over right to somebody. Okay, so then I stop and ask them, what's the goal of volleyball? Uh, get a few answers. I think it was to put the ball on their court and have it land there. Okay? So after a while, here's how our players would play. I'll just steal a ball, Sarah. They will start to set so the ball is right there and they can do that and maybe we got to create some new rules about what they can and can't do. But people don't do that. I think it got pretty patent. Was there ever any time, do you want to just come? I'll be one of the three. Just toss a ball in. Here we go. Yeah. Did anybody ever do that on two, right? Or one, or back bump right over because they, did, they could see that they didn't rotate fast enough. Never, right? Pass, set, shoot, over and over and over. But since the game is random, shouldn't we do some of that, which I think John's talked a lot about injury prevention. Can we do some full court spatial awareness things that's building some skill and not taxing and adding too many jumps to the game. Uh, so I've sort of said sometimes if I had to pick a team and you told me you can't watch them hit, block, that, I might pick this drill just because there's a lot of things and the competitive ones are going to find a way to win. 